So let's see how to create an NX workspace with a NestJS uh, preset application, server side application. So here we have how to create an NX workspace, NPX create NX workspace. The, the, in the tutorial, the default preset is Angular, but now we are going to use um, not Angular, but uh, Nest. So we are going to use preset Nest. Okay, this is a preset that is visible. Okay. So this will take some time to download and check the NX project. Okay, so now uh, NX is asking for the workspace name. And then we have several presets. So, okay, I'm going to use Nest. This will create a single Nest application instead of that. Although we can also choose like Angular Nest. But in this case, I'm going to choose Nest. And then the application name. Okay, and we can use an X Cloud. This is recommended if you want to use the features of NX Cloud. But even if you don't use NX Cloud, uh, NX will also work just fine. Okay, so it will be downloading. At first, this will take quite some time. But I would say after the second project, and then the project is done. All right, so now that the project is here, and we can open it in Visual Studio Code. Okay, this will be our workspace. And then we can uh, run yarn to install the needed packages. Okay, it's not yet recognized. Okay, let me change the shell into command prompt let's see if this will work not yet okay i'll try to restart visual studio code and try again all right So now Yarn is installing the dependencies for this project. And while waiting, NX provides um, Visual Studio Code extension to make it easier for us to work with NX projects. So we can search NX and then we can install NX console here. Now all of the NX commands you can use from the terminal or command line. However, if you install this NX console extension in Visual Studio Code, 
now it will show up here in the sidebar so you can uh, run targets in nx and after this is done then we will try to run serve here now we can see that the structure of this workspace is that we have this uh, parent workspace and then our actual projects are inside apps and libs and actually the nest project here is inside apps here now to run it we can run an x serve and then we serve this project called tamra and then we can run go all right so now this says that this project is now running at the call host 3333 slash api so i'm gonna copy this Open my browser here okay and as you can see now we have a nest.js project inside this nx workspace and the source code for this one is here and this is the main entry point but the actual controller for that is here so this has this app service get data which is inside the surface and actually the service is here so if i want to change it uh, hi i am just a tutorial and i save it and it, it will restart when you go here and then refresh it's changed okay so i hope this is useful for you to create a new nx uh, project with netjs